Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's Autos. In this video, I'll be showing you AMD Radeon software not opening on Windows 11. Before we start, hurry up and check out these software just on this video. Let's get started. So, if you're having problems with AMD or the Radeon software here and it's not opening on Windows, well, there are a few things that you could try doing. So, first things first is you want to close or you want to make sure that AMD Radeon is fully closed from your PC. Now, sometimes it might be running in the background. That's why it's not open up for you. But if it's running in the background, usually, usually it's stuck on a very specific process. So, shutting it down and opening it up again can solve the issue. So, you want to go ahead and just press Control shift escape on your keyboard or you want to go to the search bar here and just type in Task Manager. Now, in Task Manager here, you want to look for AMD Radeon. Now, if you do see AMD Radeon here, you just need to right click on it and just choose the end task option here. Now, once you have this closed, what we need to do next is you want to open it up. So you want to go to your search bar here, just type in AMD Radeon and you want to go ahead and just right click on it and just choose the run as administrator option. Now, once you've done this, this will run AMD Radeon software as administrator and hopefully this will, this will solve your issue. But if this doesn't solve your issue, the next thing that you want to do here is you want to go ahead and visit your uh, local app data. So you want to go to your search bar here, just type in uh, run and you want to open up the uh, system app for it. And you want to type in the following, it's going to be percentage local app data percentage and click on OK. Now what we are looking for here is going to be a specific folder for uh, Radeon itself. So in here, you want to go and just look for the AMD folder inside the local folder. And you want to open up the AMD folder and you want to look for the CN folder. Now you want to go ahead and just right click on the CN folder here and delete this specific folder. Now, by the way, don't worry with deleting this folder. This is just temporary files that is stored in your PC. So it's pretty much safe to delete. But once you've deleted that, go ahead and see if that solves the issue. Now, if this doesn't solve your issue, there might be some glitches on the actual software. So what you need to do is you want to go ahead and uninstall AMD Radeon. So usually you just need to go to search, just type in uninstall, open up the installed apps option here. And you want to go ahead and basically look for AMD Radeon and just uninstall it from your PC. So go and click on the 3 option here, click on uninstall. Now, once you have that uninstalled, you want to go ahead and open up the official website for it and download the update. Now, once you've downloaded the, up the software or the installer itself, you want to go and run it and see if that solves the issue. Now, once you've installed it, make sure to restart your PC and see if that helps. And that's about it. So if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.